You're thinking of trying bouldering. You might have seen PewDiePie climbing those big walls and becoming that alpha male that he's nowadays. Or maybe you've seen the videos of Magnus. Magnus! Even his name is like Adonis. Magnus. Felix. That's my name. I'm curious about bouldering too. So today I went and did it for the first time. Yeah, my brother and me went to Le Conde de Bass in Brussels. We're here with the brother. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. The cool thing about bouldering is that it's pretty cheap. It just costs 15 euros with the shoes to, for the entire day, but if you want to try it for an entire month, it just costs 40 euros, which is more or less what a gym could, would cost, so not too bad. Apparently the shoes have to be very tight, which makes them very uncomfortable, at least to me. In most of the gyms in the world, the grading of the difficulty of every line that you follow in bouldering is based on a V or verming scale. Essentially, it's a quotation between 0 and 17, 17 being the hardest, if I understood properly. Right, so here are the levels of this place. But here they just have colors and cool names like Ninja and uh, Fire God or stuff like that. Today we're going for ninja, right? <laughs> Su. Su. Okay, here's the game plan. We've never done this before and we want to try it. So let's start with the basics. Green color, if we can do green, we will go to blue, or oh, orange, blue, and climb up and see how good we are. And eventually maybe we'll get at the level of PewDiePie or other cool YouTubers. So, yeah. Okay. All right, let's warm up a bit. Show us what you got. Muscle up, go. You can't. Oh shit, he can! <laughs> now he put me on the spot, now I have to do it. <laughs> Come on, Felix. Smooth. He broke all of his joints, but he did As it was my first time, I had to start with the green, which is the easiest. If we can't do the easiest, I will feel very disappointed about me. There's a cross here, so this is where you have to get. Apparently, we have to get to the one that I'm narrow, and apparently you have to have both hands on it for three seconds. So it actually counts and you did it. And because I have an ego the size of the moon, I thought I would be able to do the hardest one today. Things didn't go exactly as planned. So I think the green level, it's easy enough that we can skip it and go to the next one, which is the orange. So let's do the orange. Oh, let's not count that one, but... <laughs> At this point, I was feeling very confident. Everything seemed so easy. I finally made it to this orange path, which would be the beginning of my demise. <laughs> That's so hard, but you need to grab it with like the fingers and I don't have finger strength. You fail. You fail. You fail. You fail. You fail. You fail. I just couldn't do it. <laughs> so if we if we can agree on something is that I think PewDiePie is very strong. Like it looks easy when he does it. But it's very hard. <laughs> it was so hard finding the balance between having small grips, no finger strength, no foot strength, no ability. I felt like such a loser. And it was just the, no the level number two of like 10. That's a rabbit. I can't do this one. Maybe next time, runner. I just can't do it. It's too hard. I just don't have the strength. I don't have the dexterity. My hands are getting old. No, 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 no. People don't want to see a lame ass video where you give up, bro. People want to see struggle, bro. Where's the fucking point of struggle? Get that part. But I couldn't give up. Mostly because my brother did it in the second try and I couldn't do it. And I can't be worse than my brother. Show us what you got. <laughs> so I persevered. What would PewDiePie say? You know, if you do a mistake once, fine. A couple times, fine. But enough times, and it's just become real. Oh god. Oh no. I take back everything I just said. What would Magnus say? How much oil do you have? <laughs> <laughs> That's usually how I start my conversation. What would Gogging say? Who's gonna carry the boats in the logs? I just couldn't give up. Already open 
the skin of my finger. You can't, can you see? I don't know if you can see it. But I know if I'm gonna continue, it's gonna hurt more, so. Of course, my brother had to be in front of the shot while I was accomplishing this. Weirdly enough, even if this was just the second level, accomplishing this thing that was so hard to me felt amazing. I think that's why bouldering is so amazing because we all have our own level and we don't need to compare each other because we already have something that we're struggling to achieve. But when we do, when we finally do it, it feels so great. Even if other people are ninjas, we are happy to achieve the orange level because we we're cool like that, you know? I'm quite impressed about how easily my hands got all messed up. It's painful. It is a painful sport. Okay, so should you try bouldering? To be honest, bouldering is really hard. It's way harder than it looks in the videos, but it's also very fun. And no matter the level you're in, you will ha find your way to have fun and to have your own challenges to achieve. So yeah, you should try it. It's a good sport and it's a tough sport. You feel very in the present because you need to concentrate to achieve the thing that you want. It is not that expensive. You probably have a gym close to your home. So go ahead, give it a try. And maybe you will find a new passion that will lead you to climbing rocks that maybe for some people are meaningless, but maybe for you will be everything that you ever wanted. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Let's go.